there was a time when nobody could read, all right? So one guy comes and he opens one book. He's got only one book all the time. Well, if you read ten books, you become a scholar. If you remember ten books, people say you are a PhD. If you know one book, you become a representative of God. How's this? Forever it's been happening, this will not work in the future. Because uh, my phone will recite all the scriptures put together at one time. <laughs> yes, it will. Yes or no? <laughs> Just because the guy knew how to read, he was acting like a representative of God. Suppose I came to California thousand years ago on a bicycle, when nobody had seen a bicycle, you don't know what it is. I came riding on these two thin wheels, wow! I came and parked here and said, I've just come from heaven on this special <laughs> God-given vehicle. <laughs> you would all bow down. So after I finish my whatever bull with you, when I want to go and rest, I take away the front wheel and sleep on it because if any of you learn how to ride, then my heavenly status will go. But a local brat, who's good for nothing, took this bicycle with single wheel and started riding it all over the place. Now I'm in trouble. This is happening. The Google lady will recite every scripture that you want. We don't know who the hell she is, <laughs> but she can tell you anything you want. She will tell you the meaning also, interpretations also, yes or no? So. Just in many ways, in many ways, because human beings by themselves did not do it, because people did not do it consciously, I think in many ways the technological developments are going to end a whole level of <laughs> nonsensical things that have been happening just because somebody remembers something, somebody can recite something. They were elevated, all this will go, very good times. But in the meantime, when one level of what we believe collapses and before you attain to clarity, there is a danger. One thing that's happening is, in the world, heavens are collapsing. Hundred years ago, how many people believed they are going to heaven? And today how many people believe they're going to heaven has come down dramatically, isn't it so? So, is it okay? Good, yeah, <laughs> real good. This happened, this happened in Alabama. Mm -hmm. 